Hey guys, it's David here at Wild Bills Motorsports. Once again, thank you for clicking the video. We know you guys here in mine are working hard, so we're here to help you play hard. Continuing with our product review videos, today we're going to be going over the Shark Evil Line 3. Like our last video, Shark is a company made in Europe, so not only are these helmets DOT approved, but they are also ECE rated for our airmen going overseas. Uh, one of the cool things about this modular helmet is uh, most modular helmets when you're riding down the road, if you do decide you need some air and you want to flip up your jaw, when you flip them up, most time jaws sit at 12 o'clock. They take the visor with them, catch a bunch of wind. Not too hot. So with this one, the Evo line is actually designed to throw the jaw all the way back, make st go to a three quarters helmet, and stay aerodynamic. Still have access to your visor and your internal sunshade. Once again, the Shark does come with a premium liner, which is removable. All you're going to do is unsnap it here down at the base, and then, like our previous video, most helmets have the dots right in the front of the forehead where the snaps on. Shark likes to use more of a brim and that's where they disconnect. So that's gonna pull out right there. Really nice soft liner. Uh, like I said, I've been riding with this helmet for a year and a half now, absolutely love it. As you can see on the inside of the helmet, there's a ton of venting. Uh, like the previous video, the Shark Raw helmet, the Evo line is also uh, capable of being used with the Shark Tooth system. That way you can get all your communications like your cell phone, your iPod, or talking in between you and other riders. Helmet does come in right around that mid 400 range, um, but after riding with it for a year and a half, I can say it's been worth every penny. Well, that does it for the Shark Evo Line 3. Uh, once again, thanks for clicking the video, and we'll see you next time.